Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever it resonates. Probably tomorrow, maybe not, could be yesterday, could be today, could be tomorrow, could be next week. <sighs> this is what could be, alright? What could be, what could be. I just blew out a candle, and it's smoking. It is smoking. What's going to happen next? <laughs> Chaos. Something is about to be turned upside down. Upheaval. I mean, that is what this is. Something may be dropped. Somebody could be losing balance. Somebody could fall down, even. Be careful. Look where you're going. If you're not paying attention, you could drop something. You could lose something. You could even get hurt. Be careful. Ooh. Eight of Cups reversed. Hmm. Somebody really could fall down. I mean, really fall down. Like, literally fall down. Um, take more time. Slow down. Slow down. As this is a message you need to hear. If you're not looking where you're going and you're trying to do too much, you could uh, get into an accident. Now, this is totally about balance. Restrain yourself. This You need to restrain yourself. Make sure that you are um, making the right decisions to keep things balanced. This is a card of purpose. It's a card of reason. Maybe somebody needs to uh, make some compromises to bring balance. If somebody is trying to do too much. And it could cause... Um, You know, you need you need to be careful, put it that way. I think we have somebody who needs to be able to balance out responsibilities, balance out their life a little bit more. Uh, this is totally about balance, okay? This is balance, this is balance. Be careful. Um, there's opposition. This is opposition and this is opposition. So there's something that is like a positive and a negative uh, a polarity here. Something is needing to be adjusted, put it that way. We need some sort of adjustments. Somebody could be overindulging. You, maybe you drink too much. Just be careful. It is a Friday night after all that I'm recording this. It's a Friday. If you get drunk... You could get in an accident. Say you're going out drinking. You think you're going to drive home. You've had... You don't think you've had too much to drink? Be careful. You might want to just stop. Okay, I don't know where this is coming from. But I feel like there could be an accident. And you notice the cups. And it really feels like... Um, somebody could get pulled over. Whatever the case. Or get in an accident. Actual accident. Anyway, Four of Cups... Not seeing something. There's going to be some sort of disappointment. Or there is a disappointment. Somebody may be trying to self-medicate themselves with alcohol. Or drugs. This could be addictions. And they could, you know, lose their balance. And uh, it could end up costing them some money. Put it that way. This is a message that somebody needs to hear. Death. Oh, somebody could even get hurt. I'm just telling you right now. It's time for a change. And the universe is insisting on change. There's going to be a change. There's going to be a change. Somebody... Uh, 
<laughs> I think that if, if there is somebody that is planning out going out drinking and driving tonight, if I was you, I would reconsider. And that's my advice. Um, nine of swords reversed. This is... Somebody is trying to mask their pain. Somebody is absolutely trying to mask their pain with addictions. No doubt. Trying to hide their pain. There, you know, there's an element of feeling guilty, an element of regret, an ele and there could be regret for the actions that you take. Just saying, there's going to be regret. There is going, or there already is regret. There is regret. Um, things are about to change whether you like it or not. There's going to be a conflict of some sort. There is. There absolutely is. Be prepared. There's going to be some sort of conflict. There's going to be some sort of... Uh, it's like you go out with your friends or you involve... There's a bunch of people around, If whether you're drinking or not. Whatever this scenario is, there's a bunch of people around. And I think there's going to be some situation that develops... That causes chaos and upheaval. This is the universe forcing a change. Somebody has been repeating the same patterns over and over and over again. Not seeing that there was a better opportunity... <sighs> To uh, deal with their insecurities. Not seeing that there was a better opportunity. Somebody has been focused on a loss. Focused on some pain. Focused on some hurt. Focused on their guilt. Focused on their regrets. Focused on a situation. Self-medicating themselves with addictions of some sort. Somebody may not even wake up. They could, you know, overdo it. Like, what's that called? Um, shit. What is that called when you overdo it? And I'm sure somebody's got a bunch of people are going to write it underneath. Overdose. Overdose. There could be a drug overdose or uh, even an alcohol overdose. I mean, you know, people can die from that, I imagine. I'm, I'm, I think. I'm not sure. I think they can. But it feels like somebody could die from an addiction overdose. They could overdo it. Oh, God. Why do you give me this? I don't like to hear this shit. God. And this is all just a big game, right? It's all just a big game. This game is about to end. Game, end. Now, this is this is coming out of darkness. Seeing the light. Five of, five of pentacles reverse. Somebody could be seeing the freaking light. The end of difficulty right here. And this is leaving somebody behind. Giving up. Self-medicating. Right? Somebody is giving up. They're self-medicating themselves. They may overdo it. And <laughs> what is the middle card? Be careful. I mean, see this is laying in a bed? Be careful. Somebody may not wake up. I'm sorry to deliver this message. This reading may or may not be for you. You may hear about it. You could be the one that hears about it. Somebody may have left without saying goodbye. Why did I put those out? I don't know. The end of a partnership. We have somebody, I mean, this is very unhappy. They could, you know, <laughs> well, there could be an upcoming celebration. This is a celebration of life, a celebration of death, 
in life, okay? Unexpected. This is when it's in reverse. It's very unexpected. Happens just like that. A change in a foundation. The end of a happy situation. And maybe it wasn't happy. Obviously, it wasn't. If somebody is over-medicating and doing drugs and going overboard, somebody is going overboard. Absolutely. And it's because they're do so discontent and they're so sad over a previous relationship loss. They're masking the pain. There is a new doorway here. There's a new path, a new door that is opening. This is a new door. This is a new enterprise. Somebody is manifesting a new beginning and there is a new path unfolding. And it's like there's a message coming or a messenger coming that is going to lead or give somebody the opportunity to go through a new door. That's going to happen. Oh, jeez, some girl. I don't like these messages. I told you that already. Son of a bitch. I don't like them. <laughs> so what is that? What is that? Somebody who wants to bring you uh, rainbows, lollipops, and candy will tell you that this is a need to take a break. This is a need to rest. This is a need to medicate. What does the, or the need, not the need to medicate, the need to meditate. They will tell you that. I am not lollipops and candy. I don't even like lollipops. I don't really like candy either. Anyhow, um, this is a death. This is the death of an idea or a person. Fours are about foundations. There is a foundation that is about to experience some upheaval, chaos. Something is about to go down. A new door is about to be opened. And one door is being closed. Definitely. A door, this is a door being opened. That would be a door being closed. There is a door that is being closed. One door opens. Or one door closes, one door opens. That makes sense. This is not what you want to hear. This is not good news. Uh, somebody may deliver the news that is this person is, like I said yesterday, childish. Uh, they don't think before they talk. They don't think about, um, you know, who they're hurting. This person is, uh, what's the word for it? I'm trying to be nice here. This person is, it's not like the, the Page of Swords. This person just doesn't know. The Page of Swords knows what they're doing. And they just say it, the page of swords, they know what they're doing. This person is just not very, I'm trying to be nice here, doesn't think. Okay, this person is just like, <sighs> they say things without thinking, impulsively. So something is going to happen. Something is going to, something is going to be said. And it's not good news. They don't even realize what they're saying. This person doesn't. It's just like stupid. I'm sorry. I know you guys aren't going to like that. This is somebody who is just like <sighs> lacking common sense. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's what it is. So we have somebody here that is going to blurt something out about something. This is somebody who blurts something out. And it's going to change dynamics, change something. Hmm. And somebody's going to decide to give to somebody else or give to another situation. This is also about give and take. 
It's funny because we got this one upright and this one reversed. On one hand, you got something positive, and on the other hand, you got something negative. <laughs> oh, okay, all right. So we got something positive. We got some. We have a. We have some. We have a. A negative situation that is changing into something positive through the death of something. Okay, so through the death, through through endings, bring new beginnings. So something is about to end. There's something is about to change. There's a reason. There is a purpose. There is a purpose. You have to see the darkness to see the light. From darkness to light. But if you never saw the darkness, you would never see the light. So, somebody is going to experience a period of darkness that leads them to the light. There could be an upcoming death. Okay? Somebody could die. They could die in a car accident. I'm just saying, because that's what I saw. There could be a car accident. I hope that's not the case. I pray to God that that is not the case. But um, they could be on drugs. It could be, you know, if I was you, I wouldn't even go out on the roads. Put it that way. I would not I would not go out on the roads. I'm not trying to scare anybody. And I know there's people that will ignore this message, right? Because they think that they are invincible. You are not invincible. And you can't live in fear. I know that you can't live in fear. Do whatever you want. Somebody is going to get exactly what they deserve. Put it that way. So if you are safe, have at it. Something's about to go down. Stay home. Good luck.